watch till the end if you're brave. The White Lady of Belit Drive. The White Lady of Belit Drive is a popular urban legend in the Philippines about a ghostly apparition of a white-clad woman who appears on Belit Drive in Quezon City. According to the legend, the White Lady is said to be the spirit of a young woman who died in the 1950s. She is believed to haunt Balet Drive, a winding road in Quezon City, where she was either killed in a car accident or died under mysterious circumstances. Witnesses claim to have seen her ghostly figure walking alone on the road, dressed in white, often at night. Some accounts describe her as a beautiful woman with long hair, while others describe her as a vengeful spirit who causes accidents or terrorizes drivers. The legend has it that if you encounter the White Lady, you will experience bad luck, accidents, or even death. The story has evolved over time, with various versions and sightings reported, making the White Lady of Belit drive a legendary and eerie figure in Philippine folklore. That's spooky. Comment below if you live in the Philippines. If I see her, I'm running. Let's look into another Philippines urban legend. The Headless Priest. The Headless Priest is an urban legend in the Philippines about a decapitated priest who roams the streets of Manila, particularly in the areas of Intramuros and San Miguel. According to the legend, the Headless Priest was a Spanish friar who lived during the colonial era. He was beheaded by natives who resisted the Spanish occupation, and his body was left on the street. Now, his ghost is said to roam the streets, searching for his missing head. Some versions of the story claim that he was an evil priest who was punished by the locals. Witnesses claim to have seen a headless figure in a priest's robe, often accompanied by a faint smell of candles and incense. Some reports say that the headless priest is seen carrying a candle searching for his head, while others claim he is seen holding his own severed head. Sightings of the headless priest are believed to be an omen of bad luck, or even death. The legend has been passed down through generations, and many believe that the headless priest still haunts the streets of Manila to this day. Imagine seeing a headless priest in your closet. I'm scared. Do you guys believe this is true? Comment below what other urban legends should I do next?